Okay, in this demo, I'm going to be showing you how to do the notch block, which requires two sketches. So if we look at the notch block, the overall size stays the same. It is 6 inches long by 2 inches tall by 3 inches wide. And we have a notch out of this that is 2 inches by 1 inch, and it's 1 inch deep. So I've created a new document. I'm naming it Notched Block. And I'm clicking OK. OK, so the first thing you need to do, as always, you need to start a new sketch. And in this case, I'm going to use the top view for it. And then I'm going to look down on the top. So since I need to make the first sketch as the overall size of the block, it's a rectangle. So I'm going to use the Rectangle tool. And I'm going to start in the middle. One click to start, the second click to end the rectangle, and immediately I take my hands off the mouse and type in the size. Six, enter. Three, enter. I change my camera over to the isometric, and now I can extrude this rectangle at a distance of two inches. Enter hit the green check mark. Okay, so now that I have my overall size uh, of the rectangle, 6 by 3 by 2, I am now going to start a secondary sketch, but I'm not going to choose front, top, or right this time. I'm going to choose the very top surface of this rectangle right here. I'm going to click on it when it's lit up, and I can see my sketch to show up around it. So now, I need to make that cutout notch that is 2 inches by 1 inch. So I'm going to use the rectangle tool again. And I'm going to start in this corner. And I'm simply going to drag a rectangle up and to the left. I'm going to click. And I'm going to type in 2, enter, 1, enter. OK. So now I'm going to go to my extrude tool. And notice it wants to extrude it up, but I don't want to add to the extrusion. I want to remove the extrusion. So I just click on the remove, leave it at one inch because that's the depth I want, hit the green check mark, and that's the notch block. Same. 